Hi, this is Spirit Hawk, the Native Magi. In today's Animal Spirit series, we're going to look at Hawk Wisdom. This powerful bird can awaken visionary power and lead you to your life's purpose. It's the messenger bird, and whenever it shows up, pay attention. There's a message on its way. They represent visionary power and guardianship. Their cycle of power is spring and fall equinoxes and the new moon. Hawks are one of the most intriguing and mystical of the birds of prey. They are the messengers, the protectors, and visionaries of the air. Hawk and owl have the keenest eyes of all raptors. If you study hawk medicine, you also should study owl medicine because the keynote of hawk is daytime, the keynote of owl is nighttime, and they are the yin and yang of the raptor. Hawks vary in size, appearance, and environment. There are so many different species, it's very difficult to tell them apart. There are marsh hawks, forest hawks, sea hawks, and prairie hawks. And the environment in which your hawk is found will tell you much about how its energies are likely to manifest within your life. For brevity here, most of my reference will be speaking about the red-tailed hawk. The red-tailed ties this hawk to the kundalini, the seat of the primal life force. In the human body, it's associated with the base chakra located at the base of the spine and the coccyx or tailbone. Those with a red tail hawk as a totem will be working with the kundalini and can also reflect that this bird becomes a totem in your life only after the kundalini has been activated. It can also reflect the childhood visions and dreams are becoming empowered and fulfilled. This bird may pop up as a totem at the point in your life where you begin to move forward in your sole purpose more dynamically. The red-tailed hawk is usually a permanent resident in the area, although occasionally may migrate. This permanency reflects that as a totem, this hawk will be with you permanently once it shows up. It's generally accepted that red tails mate for life, both male and female help care for the young. Two to three eggs laid in the spring, they vigorously defend their nest against any intruders, and they cling to their home territories for years. They can live up to 14 years in the wild. That number 14 is significant. The 14th card in the tarot deck is the card for temperance. This is the card that represents the teaching of higher expressions of psychism and vision. It can be used in the development of astral projection new flights out of the body. It has ties to the activation of your vital energies and the bold expression of them. Also tied to the archetypal forces that teach beauty and harmony and moderation. This bird holds the key to higher levels of consciousness. Rising to a higher level can bring rapid development of the psychic energies. The red-tailed hawk helps us in balancing and using those senses appropriately. It teaches the balance necessary to discover our true purpose in life. When you have a red tail as a totem, meditation on the 14th card will help you see how this hawk will lead you to use your creative energy in manifesting your soul's purpose. The red of the red tail reflects a greater intensity of energy at play within your life. It reflects an intensity of physical, emotional, mental, and spiritual forces. This bird is a catalyst, stimulating hope and new ideas. It reflects a need to be open to the new or shows you ways you may help teach others to be open to the new. The beak and the talons are always commented on by observers. They're the most striking features of any hawk, especially the red tail. This is a fearless bird and will even take on poisonous snakes. It has a scaled leg to help protect it against poisonous bites, and immediately upon grasping its snake prey, it tears off the head. Because of the strong energy and the intensified life force of the red tail activated by this totem, an individual with it must be careful in how they express themselves. There will unfold within you the ability to tear off the heads of any snakes in your life or anything or anyone seen as an enemy. Your comments and actions 
will be like the hawk's beak and talons, strong and powerful, but with the capability to tear or kill. The feathering of the red tail actually has two phases. Both of these are significant to anyone with this totem. Its feathering is a little lighter during the summer and darker during the winter. The lighter is often symbolic of more joyful and sociable kinds of energies. The darker phases can reflect a time to be alone or to withdraw a little bit. The red tail and its color phases also help us guard against blazing so brightly and intensely that we get burned out. The sky is the realm of the hawk. Through its flight, it communicates with humans and with the great creator spirit. It awakens our vision and inspires us to a creative life purpose. Excerpts taken from the book Animal Speak by Ted Andrews. Your time is the most important thing you can give to someone. And today I thank you very much for your time. I thank you for your interest in Native American spirit guides and I hope that you will subscribe to my channel. We have more of these on animal spirits coming up for you in the future. So please check back to see and you can also make requests to me at the Native Magi at gmail.com. If you'd like to hear about any particular animal spirit guide, I'd be happy to present that for you. Thank you again very much for your time, and may the great spirit Wakantanka bless you in all things.